morning hot tots and welcome back to my channel so i just woke up at 7 30 in the morning my first call isn't until nine that's usually what decides for me when i'm going to log on for work it's either eight to nine o'clock is when my first call always is somewhere in that hour so let's go oliver is waiting for me to feed him I don't know if I showed you guys this room yet, but I brought my desk from downstairs up here now that I have the big L-shaped desk downstairs. I brought my couch up. I need to figure out, these are all under my bed. It's just all stuff I save, like pictures and you know, knickknacks. Um, I need to figure out where to put all of that. Um, this is the nice clothing rack that I'm going to put together, but yeah. Redid this room. I'm going to be making it my YouTube room. Me and my big shirt I sleep in. All right, let's go downstairs. He's ready for us. So lately I've been having like one room temperature water in the morning with lemon in it. Just like half of a half squeezed in. And then I take that lemon and put it into my big water. And then I also just put another one in my big water and squeeze that in. So I squeeze that in there and then put that in there too. There. Bottoms up. And then I've been drinking this because my Kroger was out of Starbucks and I really like it. 15 calories for 12 fluid ounces. And if you've been following me, you know that I don't count my first cup of coffee, um, the creamer or anything. So I'll just pop that off. Put some in there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. There we go. And then I use Italian sweet cream, the full fat. And I do about like two tablespoons. So basically I don't count about 70 calories of my day because I just don't. Also down here, here's my L-shaped desk. I put together if you didn't see it on my Instagram and then the couch is gone and then my brother and sister my brother-in-law and sister are going to come get my queen size bed to use for their daughter but it's all empty now so I'm going to actually go walk for about 10 minutes since I have 10 well I actually have my meeting at 8 30 but I could actually listen and walk, so I might do that too, but just to get a little walking in, so just gonna get my shoes on and walk just a little bit so I get some movement in this morning. I think I'll be back. So pretty out. So I walked a mile, finished my call. I'm making sure that my video was up for today. <laughs> and you know, drinking water, drinking coffee. And that's it. My face is looking so much better lately. So if you didn't know, I'm a beauty counter consultant and I use the counter time regimen 
I'll show you guys it later, but I have been like not really washing my face lately. I've been like just taking my makeup off and like rinsing my face with water because I just was so lazy. I didn't even want to do my skincare. And I could really tell. And now I've been like consistently doing it again. And it's just like, oh, finally I'm back. But you guys, I don't want to work. <laughs> okay, so it's only 11.17, but I am so hungry. Oliver is too. <laughs> So I think what I want to do for lunch is make a chicken Caesar wrap. Um, I have all of this lettuce. I might even make a little side salad as well. I had these out, but I don't know if I use them. But anyways, I think I'm going to cook up some chicken, season it in the air fryer, and then add some lettuce, some Parmesan crisps, and a little Caesar dressing inside of the wrap. And then on the side, maybe have a side salad or I don't know yet. Um, I'm going to figure it out. But first, I'm just going to cut up one or two of these little tenders, place them in here, and then add my normal seasoning, which I put onion powder, garlic powder. Um, and then lately, I've been putting like a little cayenne pepper, you know, just whatever seasonings I feel, and then putting them in the air fryer until they're done. And yeah, I'm trying to think if there's anything else I need. Oh, I'll put some carrots in there too. Screw it. And then maybe some carrots on the side as well. <laughs> Lots of carrots today. Um, but I don't have any Parmesan cheese right now. So that's why I just think I'm going to use these crisps. I really like these in my salad that one day. So, okay. So I measured out three ounces. I'm going to cut this up into little pieces, keep it on here, and then add onion powder. Like I said, a little Lowry season salt. Cajun seasoning and some garlic powder. I'm at the very end. I have barely anything left. Put it in there. I just have it at 400 degrees. I switch it on and I check on it. I have no idea the amount of minutes I keep it in there. I just always check on it as I'm putting everything else together. So I'm going to do that. And then this should be an eight point lunch with just the sandwich. I'm going to use four points worth of my Caesar dressing, which is two tablespoons. It's worth it to me to have regular Caesar dressing. So it is what it is, people. I've tried all of the low-fat ones, okay? And then this is one point, so four, five, six, seven. And then I'm doing six crisps, which is a point, so eight. All right, they're in. All right, so now I'm just adding my wrap on here. I'm going to do six crisps. So one, two, three, four, five. They're kind of broken, so I'm putting a little couple on there. Six. And that's what they look like, and I'm just gonna break them up. Kind of just like break them all up. Like that. And I'm gonna add some of my carrots. I love pre-chopped carrots like this for in wraps and on salads. Just put some of those in there. Put some of my lettuce I got from Trader Joe's recently. Has some radishes in it too. Just put that on there. like so far now I'm just turning this on I'm putting it to grams zeroing it out and then I'm going to put two tablespoons onto here so I'm actually going to deduct two points because I only ended up using one tablespoon and I think that's going to be good so it's going to be a six point lunch for me and then a four point lunch for blue and purple because you guys don't have to pay for the chicken. <laughs> so I'll just wait for my chicken to get ready. All right, here's my chicken. I just like cut open the chubbiest one <laughs> and see if it's white inside and they're all good to go. So there it is. I'm just gonna roll it up. Okay, I had just a little bit of Takis. They're the uh, chili and lime from Trader Joe's. You can get 15 of these for four points, but I just did eight of them. Um, or nine, I forget, for two points. So this will be an eight-point meal, and this is going to be my lunch.
Squish looks delicious. Of course, a little grape on the side. All right, guys, we're gonna make the skinny-ish dishes, chicken and dumplings. So it calls for one cup of celery, one cup of onions, one cup of carrots, one and a half pounds of chicken, five cups of water, two tablespoons of two tablespoons of this, one and three fourths cup of milk, four tablespoons cornstarch, cooking spray, salt and pepper, and then for the dumplings, two cups of flour, yada yada. I'll put it down below. But we're gonna make it. I just wanted to tell you guys, I went to clean, like take out my celery. Look how dirty it is. It is so dirty. I had to scrub this celery down. So nasty. But I'm gonna cut everything up and then just show you guys what I do so it takes a lot less time. Okay, okay. So I'm heating this up. I actually don't have the to top to it anymore, so I have to use a different top, so hopefully that works. I must have lost it in the movie, guys, because I don't have my crock pot top. But anyways, let me cut all this stuff up and then I'll show you what I'm doing. Okay, so as you can see, I cut up a cup of onions, a cup of celery, and then I'm just gonna do a cup of carrots. It says to place all of this in the slow cooker. Uh oh. Oh no. I missed just a little bit. It's okay. I'll do a cup of carrots. Nice. You know, just eyeballing. Then place chicken breasts and pour five cups of water over everything. So this is one and a half, well, 1.36. So I really only need, actually this will be work perfect. So I just need this whole thing and then just like one of these tenders. So I'll just place this all in the slow cooker. Okay, Oliver, you're gonna drive me nuts. I can already tell. And then five cups of water over everything and add two heaping tablespoons of this. So one, two, three, four, five. Two heaping tablespoons. You know, you gotta make them a little intense. Smells like baby food. Mix that all in. Gross. And set your crock pot to low or high. Okay, so we're gonna do extra high because I'm hungry and I started making this too late in the day. Okay, so while that's going through that, Oh, I have to wait until that's almost done and then the next steps. So to be continued, we might have a snack and stuff in between because it's five o'clock. It says it takes like two to three hours. So we might not be eating dinner until like 7.30. <laughs> Didn't plan that out correctly, so we'll just see. Okay, so I'm gonna have a little seven point <laughs> snack. I'm having one piece of this raisin swirl it's four points for a piece which really annoys me since one slice is only 100 calories but whatever four points for this and then one tablespoon of my jiff whip which sometimes i use a half a tablespoon so we'll see it's three points for one tablespoon um but i just like to toast this up and eat this as like a little snack lately i love it so i'm gonna eat that to try to hold me over until this is done which it might not so we might have multiple snacks this will only be seven points for one serving, so I will have a lot of points if I want to eat more or if I want to have like another snack or, you know, an additional meal since I only eat two a day, basically. So I'm going to eat that. So 16.5 grams is uh, one tablespoon, and I'm only at 11 grams, and I think this is good. I'm going to see if that would deduct my points at all. If not, I'll just use the full 16, um, but we'll see. Yep, it makes it two points instead of three, so I'll go ahead with that. So this will be six points, and that's gonna be my little snackaroonie. It looks really delicious. Okay, it's almost seven. I'm gonna take the chicken out and see if I can cut it all up. And then it just says I have to get put the milk in, 
and cornstarch and then put it into the crock pot and place, place the cover back on while I make the dumplings. Okay? Okay, so you do one and three fourths cup of milk and then you whisk in four tablespoons of cornstarch. So I'll do one at a time and whisk it and do it until I got the four tablespoons and then I pour it into the crock pot. Okay. Okay, my phone's about to die, so I hope it doesn't die before this. So I need to do two cups of flour. Oh no, it's wet. This is a half cup, so two cups. Two cups of flour, yeah. Dang, that's a lot of flour. Gee, my Christmas. Two cups of flour together with one and one half teaspoon of baking powder. Yeah, so that's a half and then I need one, two, so one and one half teaspoon of baking powder. And then one teaspoon of Lowry salt. Oh my gosh, this is not a big enough bowl. <laughs> okay, we gotta change bowls, people. Okay, moving on to a bigger bowl. Well, this one is still a little wet from my last thing I was doing. Um, seasoning salt, butter melted. Okay, didn't melt the butter. This is one tablespoon, so let me melt some butter. <laughs> okay, so here's some butter that took like one second. Okay, and then I need three fourths cup of a milk. The milk in this. It's three fourths the cup. I'll just pour a little as I stir. Not the smartest thing I've ever done. Didn't think the whisk through, guys. Not a smart idea. Okay, so basically from here it says have like a teaspoon or tablespoon and make little like little scoops you know, and then just drop them in there. And then they'll have to cook up, so I'm so hungry. So you take the little circles, and then you just pop them in. Or it said if you wanna be smarter than that, do a bunch of them, and then pop them in all together, which is what I'm gonna do. There's just so many dumplings. Like, that's a lot of dumplings, dude. <laughs> How big? Is it like a teaspoon size? That's tiny. I'm just going to keep doing this and then dump them in. Okay, I did it. It looks really weird. <laughs> Oop, we forgot one. Boop. Now I'll just wait like for a half an hour or something and see. It says to wait an hour, but I can't wait that long. It's already 7.20. <sighs> I didn't think this through as I mentioned before. So I'm starving. <laughs> well, in the meantime, I'm going to clean up my room. I need to clean up all these clothes. This was from yesterday. I need to make my bed, even though I know I'm going to bed soon, but I wanna make it. I want to organize this and put clothes in here and put the wheels on it. Maybe put together my shoe rack, <laughs> put that in my extra bedroom. I also want to like take this out and look through all the stuff and then maybe put like my underwear and socks are in here and then bathing suits and stuff. So maybe switch some of that to there. Like, I don't know, but put this stuff in there too and figure it out. So I'm going to do that. And my phone is about to die or else I would just do like a fast whatever, but I'll just do before and after for you guys. Well, I've now made more of a mess, but we've organized the sports bras. We have all the undies, socks, and like miscellaneous like hose and random socks in here, like day-to-day -day bralettes. This is all the stuff that was just randomly in all of these drawers. So, <laughs> and my laundry that I need to fold and put away. So, made a mess and uh, now we're hungry and going downstairs, so. Okay, let's check it out. Okay, that does not look like dumplings, you guys. It all went into one thing. <laughs> So that's interesting. You guys, it literally made it all onto the top. So I'm just gonna like throw that out. <laughs> I 
and just eat the soup, I guess. Like, what the heck? Okay, actually, I tasted them, and it just is because I must have just, like, not dropped them in correctly. I don't know, but this still tastes good. It just tastes like a biscuit, you know what I mean? Like, it does taste like how dumplings are supposed to. They just weren't cut up at the time. I mean, I don't know. What the heck, guys? What the heck? But here is the final product. Took so long to make because I didn't time this correctly. So here, let me just try the soup and then I'll try the dumpling in front of you. Even though it's like a top biscuit more on mine, but. So hot, but really good. Now, here's a dumpling. And like I said, I think it's just because I plopped them all on the top and they must have just like not gone down. They just all stood at the top. So I don't know. But they taste good. So that's all that matters. That was very scary at first. I was like, oh my God, if this tastes bad, I'm going to freak out because I'm so hungry. <laughs> but I have a double portion um, so, because I'm starving. This is, I think, five points for a cup and a half for blue and purple, and then seven points for green, so it's 14 points for my big bowl. I had 16 points left, so I have two points left for dessert. Oh my god, it's so hot. Okay, I'm gonna go eat this. It is good. I probably did something wrong for the dumpling situation. We're not shocked about that, but the dumplings taste good. So that's all that matters. I swear, like nothing ever goes the right way for me, but I hope that makes me relatable. I guess if I could describe myself as a YouTuber in one word, it would be relatable or that's two words, hot mess. <laughs> two points left. So I did a two point little um, sugar-free pudding with fat-free ready whip on top. It's gonna be so good. I was gonna do a little fruit, but I had those grapes for lunch. I thought I had strawberries and I don't. So that made me really sad. Um, but I didn't feel like having an apple for some reason. So I either had apples or grapes to pick from. I was like, no, I'll just do my two point little pudding cup and go to bed because it's 9.06. My room is a wreck now. So that's going to drive me nuts all day tomorrow. You guys know me. I'm really mad at myself that I started this. I'm so tired because I've been trying to lower the amount of caffeine I have to, in a day. So I had a coffee this morning and that was it. And then uh, and I didn't even drink the whole coffee. Um, and I've just had water the rest of the day. And I'm just, I'm not like, I mean, if I want to pop, I'll do it because I have pop. But I'm just trying to lower my caffeine intake and like, um, you know, kind of lower my acidity. I haven't had too bad of acid reflux, but I've been having it on and off. Um, but you know, just trying to like cut back on, I was drinking a lot of pop recently. So I was like, we need to calm that down. But anyway, I am so tired when usually I'm like ready to rumble at like nine. I'm like doing other things and that's when I get my second wind. Not today. So gonna eat this and then I'm gonna get my outfit ready for tomorrow because I'm going to Orange Theory. I signed up for five days this week. <laughs> so wish me luck everybody. But yeah, I'm gonna eat this. It's gonna be delish and not nutrish, but very delish. Our nightly ritual. <laughs> Ollie's ready for me to turn the water on. He likes it at a very slow trickle. This is his bathroom. Whenever I say, whenever I'm like, Ollie, do you want your water? I want to go to your bathroom. He knows exactly what I'm talking about. It's so cute. But he gets his water and then I get my water. Bring my tripod into my bedroom. <laughs> I put tape on the floor because Ollie was scratching right here at night when he wants to get in. 
And I want to make sure it doesn't bring up the carpet. I have to get like, I need to get like clear tape. You guys, um, <laughs> why? <sighs> so I think for tonight, I'm going to place all that stuff. Well, actually, I might put sleepwear and like cozy wear, put some stuff in there and then I'll go to bed. Oh, geez. And then I got to pick out my outfit. I'm going to wear this Yvette sports bra tomorrow. I have so much Yvette sportswear. It's like all of these bras are Yvette besides the two of these. <laughs> okay. I have a problem. But anyway. And then, oh gosh, guys, I feel overwhelmed. Why did I start this? Okay. Anyways, I'll show you guys when I'm done if I get anything additional done. I'm only going to work on it for like 15 more minutes because then I want to relax and just be able to like woo-saw before I go to bed because I have orange theory tomorrow morning early all the rest of the week. <laughs> but I'm ready, guys. I'm ready. Get some guns. Okay, like 30 minutes later. I just have to push this like over so one of those can fit and then put the other one in there. Um, I have like two little buckets in there I have to get rid of. This is all stuff that needs put away. <laughs> so doing that tomorrow. And then I picked out my gym outfits, my Yvette sportswear bra, Yvette leggings, and then a white little Target shirt. So we're ready for the gym. But that's it for today's video, guys. Thank you so, so much for watching. I'm going to start another video tomorrow, so you'll see me die at Orange Theory probably, and then probably put all this crap away, and then probably put the things together in my YouTube room. <laughs> but thank you guys so, so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't, because it really helps support my channel. I post every Monday and Thursday. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.